हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई एम मधुरा वेलकम टू मधुरा रेसिपी डॉट कॉम टुडे विल सी हाउ टू प्रिपेयर ब्रेड क्रम्स एट होम नाउ इट्स रियली सुपर सिंपल एंड इजी टू मेक ऑल यू नीड इज ब्रेड स्लाइसेस सो द बेस्ट ब्रेड फॉर मेकिंग ब्रेड क्रम्स आर वाइट ब्रेड और होल वीट ब्रेड विदाउट एनी सीड्स और होल ग्रेन्स इन दैट अवॉइड यूजिंग ब्रेड दैट इज टू सॉफ्ट and the breads like uh, italian or french loaves works really well for making this bread crumbs so today over here i'm using this white bread slice now uh, if you are using a bread which is fresh or which is uh, very soft what you can do you can just spread out this bread slices over cutting board or on any clean surface and then just uh, allow it to sit for about an hour so that uh, it dries out little bit uh or you can use bread slice which is uh, one or two days older now uh, remove the crust from this uh, bread slice like so we are using only the soft center of this bread slice and once the edges are removed break the bread pieces break the bread in small pieces you can put this um, bread pieces into food processor and just give it few pulses but uh, today over here i am using this blender jar so put very few pieces at a time now even though this blender jar uh, will do its job really great but uh, if you add a too many uh, pieces at a time it will clog up quickly over here i have uh, ground this uh, bread slices into a coarse bread crumbs you can see that i don't like to uh, blend them into a very fine powder i just like to keep its texture as it really works bread uh, to give a coating to any uh, burger patty or any aloo tikki so i just keep little bit extra coarse texture i don't blend this into fine crumbs so once you if there is too much bread to break down so uh, blend this in batches rimmed a uh, baking tray and now i'm going to pop this tray into oven at 350 degree fahrenheit that is approximately 180 degree celsius for just 2 minutes after 2 minutes i'm going to remove this tray from oven give that a stir or mix and we'll again pop this for just 2 uh, more minutes so i have baked them for 2 minutes over 350 degree fahrenheit now give this a stir give this one more mix spread that out and now we'll again go ahead and pop this up for 2 more minutes and over here i have break this bread crumbs for two more minutes at 350 deg degree fahrenheit so total i have baked them for just four minutes and look at them they have turned nice and crispy and also it has got slight golden color now if you are looking for deep golden color i would suggest to uh, bake them for two more minutes but this one is perfect for me and also look at the texture this is on a coarse side that's what i'm really looking forward and that's all these bread crumbs are ready in no time and you could use this bread crumb for making a burger for making cutlets for making cheese balls macaroni balls or um, paneer fingers or any type of uh, deep fried snack that uh, you like to have crunchy coating on that so i hope you like to my today's recipe For more such quick and easy recipes, please visit my website that is www.madhuratrecipe.com. Developing a new taste. Also remember to subscribe on our YouTube channel. It's free, and whenever I post a new recipe, you will be the first to get informed about that. Thank you for watching. See you soon. Bye bye.